Hi viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel Curiosity Box. I am happy on the inside. Basically, this is my weekly vlog, but it's only going to be really short because I've got a book review to film after this and dinner's already cooking. I didn't really do well, I didn't really have much food because it was pretty quiet. I don't know what to say in this stupid vlog. I am happy on the inside, so please don't send me emails saying you're worried about me or anything. Not that you... I don't mind, but... It's stressful. I don't know what to say in this. I had a meltdown yesterday, because... Not yesterday, it's Saturday. Because I'm not very good at cleaning my kitchen. I'm pretty crap at that. And I... I because I was a bit worried about this bowl of peaches what I ate and there was hard bits in because it was like just a tin of peaches we pre-prepared and I was worried that because some um, I heard that some pips and stones and fruit have cyanide in so I was worried that these tiny crunchy bits that I had to cut on my mouth and my hand was covered in fruit I was like bleh, bleh. Then I was too scared to touch the bowl, so it just sat on my kitchen. And then, and then on Saturday, the ants turned up. There was there weren't too many, but there was. And then I had a meltdown because I was scared because we had ants in our old house, and they, and I remember in our old house they took over the kitchen, and then for some reason with the door between the dining room and the lounge and the, the metal bar between the rooms they decided to do a big constant marching across that and it was really stressful and my dad wasn't helping me fixing it to anything at my old house but my dad been really good and helped uh, clean my kitchen up so now um, it seems I don't know whether this I don't know what to do because no, every few hours I get a lone ant sort of poking about. There's no food left on my kitchen worktop or anything. My dad's tidied it really well, and now I'm sort of stuck in the the mind frame of uh, I'm only ever going to eat food in my mum and dad's kitchen, and I'm never going to use my kitchen again. Mind frame. So, which is what happened with my shower that don't work. So, but my dad cleaned up, but we get one lone ant scouting around for food. There's no food left, so I don't know where to keep squishing the lone ants that turn up every few hours or so, or let the lone ant go back to base camp and tell everybody else that there's not really any food. There's no point um, turning up. But I'm worried if the, uh, if I let the lone ant do that, it might find like a tiniest crumb of food and get the whole army in. So I'm squishing each lone ant. So don't... I am happy on the inside, but I'm just like really grumpy. But really grumpy, but happy, and sort of got drawing things that I'm excited about drawing and stuff. But I'm sort of in the middle of grumpy and happy, and I don't know because I don't know how, how to describe how I actually feel. Because I like going on job pitch with recipe book threads and stuff, and they make me really laugh. But I still feel kind of grumpy. And I'm sorry if I was upset and budgy by saying this. So I did do um, two pictures during the week. Yeah, I've got to think of it something for my new comic strip and I'm kind of stuck but I've got an ideas book on my consult my ideas book what I make notes in 
So this is the ideas book that I currently have to make notes for picture ideas. So, but I don't think, I think I've done all the ones that I've wrote down. So I'm not sure, because it's meant to be a comic about being autistic and difficulties with being autistic and I'm stuck on what to draw. But it probably won't turn my head later on, because I've got to do it today because it's Monday, and what's up to do on Monday? So that's the one um, I did at the start of last week. It, it is about autistic and it is about when I got over my fear of spiders by holding a tarantula. So that is on my blog, I'll see it again. Autisticinnerspace.wordpress.com And then the next picture I created, which was very well received, and I'm happy that it was, is this one with Christopher Eccleston in the bath, and that's me in the bath. And I, these pictures just come in my head fully done. And for some, in the praying mantis, and in the bathroom, and then uh, I was inadvertently dreaming looking towards sort of camera or towards the viewer, and that prompted my title, The Intruders, because it's like, who's the intruder? So, yeah, it was very well received. So, I'm going to be carry on working in A4 and doing this kind of thing. So, if people like it, I'm really happy. Then the next picture I did was this one with me and Peter Capaldi and I've been um, adventuring with my Vortex manipulator and he's turned off in the TARDIS from a sort of mucky adventure and he's a bit mucked up. The truth is I accidentally had a smudging accident but I incorporated it into the story in the picture so it turned out okay and people like it. So it's a book, was, and then I smudged my knee, but that's because I was having adventures. We were having adventures. We get mucky when we have adventures. So that's pictures that I did. And then I've got a list of the next pictures in my head. So yeah, this is my weekly vlog, and I just don't feel like doing it today. But that doesn't mean that I'm not sort of content with in the inside. Because I do have art and pictures to do. And I'm quite happy to talk with like chatting on Twitter and stuff. I just don't feel like showing it outwardly. But I, because I've got to build up the energy for this book review. And I've got to be. So. Yeah, which one is this? Is this a shaggy dog? Yeah. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this video. I hope you have a brilliant week, everybody. And see you later. Thank you for watching.